When I have a question, idea, or resource that I would like to share or discuss, I add a topic. To do so, I must join a community and add the topic using one or more of several features. Later, I can edit and even remove the topic. First, I click into the community where like-minded people are most likely to contribute to my topic. If I haven't already done so, I must join the community to post my topic. Only then will I see the Add Topic link. When I click on the Add Topic link, the Topic Dashboard opens automatically displaying the basic information fields I must complete to create a new topic. I enter the topic title, topic description, and select the category which best describes my question. Adding optional keyword tags will further describe my topic. I can publish my topic right now by clicking the Post Topic button, or continue activating additional features using the other selections in the Topic Dashboard. Either way, my new topic is instantly available to others in the community. The Resources section lets me add links or upload files relevant to my topic. Resources may be added by fellow community members when they view the topic details. The Advanced Options section lets me set up a future date when my topics will automatically appear on the topics list, or set a date to hide itself if my topic is time sensitive. If I activate the workspace, then all community members can work together on a single page of online information. I can also associate an event date with this topic which will cause it to also appear on the calendar page. Or, using the Collaborate section, I can set up a document for fellow members to check out, make changes offline, and upload the new draft, tracking the versions. When I'm done in the dashboard, I click the Go Back link to return to the Topics list. I remain the owner of this topic, so if I need to edit any of its settings or content, I can always click on the blue pencil to return to the dashboard. Should I ever choose to get rid of my topic, all of the content, comments, and resources will be completely removed from the system when I click the Dashboard Delete icon.